Peter. You started off in basketball, didn't you, Kit? That's quite a good one, too. Well, basketball was my my whole life when I was a youngster. Played in a great team at Cheyenne High School. Then went to Wyoming. We had championship teams there. I played with, a, I think, one of the best players ever, Kenny Sailors. So basketball has meant a lot to me yeah. in my career. I don't do it much anymore, but I do devote my time to it now as president of the Basketball oh, Hall yeah. of Fame. And some of the highlights of, of basketball broadcasting? Well, of course, uh, I've seen two dynasties that probably will never be duplicated again. The UCLA dynasty, I did all their NCAA championship games under John Wooden, except the first one. Wooden won his first national title, I think at the age of uh, 55. And he won with a little team, didn't have a big man on it. Uh, then he came up with uh, Al Sender, who now is known as Jabbar. And of course that team is unbeatable. Uh, Followed by uh, uh, a club uh, of uh, Wicks and Curtis Will and those players. Uh, again, without a big man. Then along came Bill Walton. Uh, he had the near-perfect game in a college basketball championship. UCLA Memphis State tied at the half of this NCAA championship game, but Bill Walton's a real star here. Leading score, 22 points. Fire shot outside. Walton up, hips it in. Johnny Wooden watches, here's a low pass inside. Walton spins and hits it. Memphis State now has to come back as UCLA is starting to run away. The shot is blocked off the hands of Larry Keaton. Walton is down in the key. He has been injured. Time is called. What a game he's played. Almost perfect. One of the greatest performances in the history of NCAA competition. 44 points. He has hit, and get this, 21 out of 22 shots. Listen to the crowd now.